Hello and welcome to ThingLink. In this short video, I'm going to be looking at 360 VR or virtual reality experiences. And with ThingLink, you can create your own very easily. And these will work with headsets such as a cardboard headset or something like a class VR viewer. And you can find out the headsets that are compatible with ThingLink in our support pages. Whenever you create a 360 experience, you'll see at the bottom that there is a VR icon. And it's this icon, when pressed, it will actually put that scene into a VR player mode. You'll see that you have your tags that you've embedded, and these will actually open in the VR experience. Now, it's always important to remember that these tags will only work with ThingLink's native tags, such as text and media or text only tags. Things like videos that are embedded from another player will not work because they are not actually part of that scene. They are a third party tool which has been embedded. So when you click on the VR headset, what does it look like? Well, of course, I'm showing you the desktop version, but here you can see the icons are now cubes which rotate. And the little dot here is where you would be able to control which cube you open with your headset. Now, this is wonderful for immersive learning experiences where you can add in things like music, which is atmospheric. It helps people experience what it's actually like to be part of that living, breathing museum or any kind of experience where you want people to have a multi-sensory experience. It makes it powerful and makes people feel part of something. Imagine viewing from an aerial point of view, what it's like to work at the top of a crane, for example, these kinds of experiences can really put people outside their comfort zones and help them learn what it might be like. But you don't have to use real life examples. You could even think about how you could bring literature to life. Here's an example where a professor of education has actually created a scene to be indicative of Dante's Inferno. And when you click on the icon here, it takes you to another 360 oh, experience Sweet. where you have music playing, which again is atmospheric. And we have virtual tags. And these are custom icons that this person has created to help give a feel and it all be in context with the subject. And of course, you can use different types of images and video for your learning experience. And these can all be brought to life using ThingLink and the 360 VR player. We hope this has been helpful and gives you some examples. There's lots of information in our support pages.